everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm still working on the shelter over there, but I'm using this tool today. This is a parabolic solar cooker. It is a very powerful way of boiling water quickly, and in terms of cooking food, that's pretty much the extent of its usefulness. You can use it for frying eggs and all manner of other things, but it's so strong that I find that the only thing that really is sensible to do with this is to boil water and to bend PVC pipe. Uh, I'm going to be uh, creating the drain for our... Uh, um, our shelter today and this is a great way of bending PVC pipe so that you can create um, you know angles in it without having to buy you know union uh, you know angle fittings and things like that so uh, I've got these couple pieces of scrap three-quarter inch PVC and I'm heating them up right here trying to find the sweet spot the easiest find to, uh, the easiest way to find where the focus point is on this to actually have a pot on it because you can see the bottom of the pot in this little reflector here but I don't have to have the exact center of it here what I just need to do is heat up this this whole area it's starting to get a little bit mushy there so I'm just rotating it around I don't want to burn it again this uh, this is a very a very strong tool I have uh, cracked a hole in a cast iron pot when I was cooking chili once it was pretty moist in there but uh, it, it was able to burn a little bit of the chili beans to the bottom of the pot, and once they burned, it uh, it allowed the uh, it allowed the uh, the thing to get you know really really hot in that one area, and then it uh, it burned a hole in the pot. So it is not to be trifled with. I made a little mark on here where I want to do the bends. This is going to be a 90 degree angle there. Come on, and obviously I've got gloves on here because it is uh, is hot. It's really hot. Let's see. I'm having a little trouble finding that focal point. Again, the easiest way to do it is to actually put a pot on the bottom, and you can look in this little mirrored reflector to make sure that you got your focal point correct. All right, yeah. Now we're starting to warm up. Three-quarter inch pipe is a little bit uh, thicker than the half-inch stuff, so it takes a little bit more more energy to. Uh, to make the bends. When you're doing it this way, you want to make sure you squeeze from the sides as you bend, because otherwise it'll kind of fold them in half. Uh, and you don't want them to fold, you want them to bend, keep it open there. Okay, that's working. So I only have a little bit of time today to actually do this. We was, uh, it was all play date this morning, um, and we just got back from the playground, but we got the perfect kind of sky for this. This is a really irritating kind of job to do when it is sort of partially uh, sunny, partially cloudy, because then, you know, you keep losing your heat. This kind of sky is great. There we go. And there is almost our 90. I know the, the runs on this camera only go about five minutes or so, so I'll call it there. I just have to hold it in place just like that, let it cool, and then I've got a nice 90-degree bend in this pipe. That's it. Thanks for watching.